told you not to take it apart. What's that to do with the price of beans? It's the curse what got us. Quit arguing. Some of us are doomed to listen to you go on forever. Yo! Ho! <laughs> what did you call me? Who said that? Captain! Captain Isabella, sir! Over here! That statue is talking to me. <laughs> that statue is talking to me. It's me, Paisley Pete, crew of the Wicked Dancer. Helped you board that Navarran brig. I remember your help. I also remember that your Captain Maldine tried to claim all the booty. Aye, and then Maldine put a curse on us, the scurvy bastard. Only another sea captain can lift it. How could a sea captain turn you to stone? The captain's a Maleficar. He always said he was calling down curses on those who wronged him. But we didn't believe it. He was a lying, cheating, scurvy bastard. Can't blame us for crossing him. I don't know Isabella will be much help. She doesn't even have a pirate crew. I have a ship? The crew is next on my list. Pirate captains are more than a ship and the dirty cutthroats will sail with them. A real sea captain is a force of nature. Like the sea herself. Like wind and tides. You hear that, Hawk? I'm a force of nature. So is Plague. What triggered the curse? And how does a sea captain figure in? We sort of broke something that wasn't ours so we could divvy it up. And now it needs to be put right. Only a sea captain can do it, though. Anyone else who tries will end up like us. And how did three stone pirates end up this far inland? Inside a duke's estate? We... borrowed some cargo from Muldeen. Thought Prosper could buy the treasure off us. But the curse caught us. The duke left us here as a warning to others. Or... Because it's funny. You're the one they need. The decision is yours. They're lying, thieving rat bastards. Pirates. What do you expect? Let's hear them out. We captured a sloop out of Antiva City, the Majestic. Mostly, she was carrying silks to Orlais. But in a strong box, hidden in the silks, was the Dagger of the Four Winds. The Dagger of the Four Winds? It's just a legend. Make us truth, Captain. It's as real as life. Pirate Treasure always has such dramatic names. Dagger of the Four Winds. Rum of Scurvy Sam. Really? The drama makes it more fun to steal. Everyone knows that. Captain Maldine didn't want nobody taking the dagger and jumping ship. So he put a spell on it. He said any blighter who took it from a rightful captain would turn to stone. But who believes in curses? We pried the jewels off the hilt to sell them to the Duke. Then the curse caught up with us. Wait. Jewels? You mean these? And this rusty old knife? That rusty is tits. That's everything. Oh, put the pieces together and you can free us. Oh, I'll see what I can do. I've put the dagger back together. Now what? Well, y y you have to... Uh... Give it away. You have to give it away and not get it back. That's the term of the curse. Let them what steal from rightful captains suffer for their greed. Only by captain's generosity can scabby bastards be freed. I could be generous without giving up the dagger. There's a lot of kinds of generosity, you know. I know it's pretty, Isabella, but it is a cursed relic. It's not cursed for me. That just makes it an ancient relic, and so pretty. Are you sure about this? You're just going to leave them here forever? Oh, no. Maker, you are such a bad influence on me. I can't leave them like this. Fine. I never want to see it again. You hear that, Maldine? Now turn them back.
We're your men for life, Captain. We swear. Even Jan. Shut up, Raleigh. Great. I lost a priceless dagger and gained three disloyal thieving sea dogs. Not a total waste, then.